Are we recording? <sighs> I think we're packing for Olympia, but I saved it for the freaking last minute. What the heck was I thinking? All right, I figured it out. What's up, you guys? Allie and I are on our way to freaking Las Vegas. We're going to Olympia, currently just outside of Barstow, and we're super excited. She's gonna be at TC1 all weekend, and I'm gonna be at the Mutant booth. Uh, this is, I think, no, you worked last year. This is my first year working. This is Allie's second year working. It's gonna be an amazing weekend. Getting your makeup done for your photo shoot. <laughs> All done? All yeah. done. Miss Allie and I just finished our shoot. What's up? Here at Olympia, here in Las Vegas for the Olympia weekend. And going back to the hotel so we can go eat and work out.
accepting the first place award. Representing Midway West, Mr. Wilton Kali and Catherine Kali. And our IFBB Pro League President, Mr. Jim Mannion. I will now announce the winner of the 2018 Olympia. We take the Sandow Trophy, the Olympia Gold Medal, the check for $400,000, and the title of 2018 Mr. Olympia. To our winner, and new Olympia Hey guys, we've got Laura here. Olympia weekend and expo is over. You can tell I'm losing my voice a little bit. It's been an amazing weekend for me. I worked with Mutant and this was my second Olympia and it's really just hitting me how grateful I should be for all of the wonderful opportunities I've had um, over the last year. Like I cannot say enough how lucky and happy I am to be working with Mutant and just such an amazing brand and to be provided opportunities and, and granted when you are given opportunities you need to show up and you need to do a good job and, and do it in a professional way with a smile on your face but this weekend was just beyond anything I imagined. Like, I got to watch finals this year, you guys. <laughs> I got to watch finals in person. Um, I got to meet people I've always wanted to meet, and I just look back at where I was a year ago when I came here last minute, just really spur of the moment with some friends. And a year later, I have five different brands that want to support me and um, believe in me and want to provide me opportunities and want me to represent them and it just makes me feel really really grateful and amazing and like I should be just pinching myself every single day when I wake up. This off season was a tough one for me. It was really tough because I just had to push myself to make my mindset tougher, more disciplined and realize that bodybuilding and the goals that I have for myself are going to require a way of life that most people don't want to live. And once I kind of really embrace that, the outpouring of support has been incredible and, and I just feel so freaking lucky. This has been the most amazing weekend. Like, it was non-stop from pretty much 4 or 5 in the morning to 11 o'clock at night with just work and team events, but it's been, it's been freaking amazing. I'm so lucky to be working with brands that are excited to have me on board, that are professional, that treat women with an incredible amount of respect, and I'm just so, so happy. Like, it's been an amazing weekend. Um, I can't say that enough. I, I feel like I'm just saying the same thing over and over. My heart just feels super full and, and happy, and I feel super motivated from these weekends at expos or big competitions like the Arnold and like the Olympia. I got to watch finals tonight, you guys. I got to see Sean Roden win Mr. Olympia. I got to see Angelica go against Ashley for Miss Bikini Olympia. And it also made my goals of, of turning pro and one day possibly competing at the Olympia seem just that much more tangible and real. I'm just really, really grateful. Life circumstances I'm in now, I try to remind myself to like look back a year, look back five years. Like five years ago, I was stuck in Indiana, in the Midwest, living with my mom and just feeling like I'm gonna waste away my 20s in this rural town in the Midwest. I couldn't compete with the job I had at the time. Just the hour and the lifestyle of doing field work were too intense. You couldn't, you couldn't do bodybuilding with that job. Fast forward like five years later, I got relocated to California. I got to compete. Um, I got the opportunity to work with brands that are freaking incredible and and I just need to do a better job of reminding myself all of this stuff every single day that I'm lucky. Not everyone gets to compete. Not everyone gets to do this. Not everyone gets the opportunities that some of us get. And I just, I should just be so grateful every single day. This weekend's been amazing. If you guys are into fitness, if you're into competing, 
going to expos and events like this, I can't tell you how much motivation I get from them. And I'm really excited for this week's workouts because I'm gonna freaking crush it on my lifts and on my cardio because of all the amazing experiences I've had this weekend. So that's really all I've got to say. It's been phenomenal, phenomenal.